Happy Metallic's future with a historically troubled project in Nashwalk is looking grim after the Minnesota DNR said today it plans to pull the company's mineral leases. The agency gave Misabi Metallics a May 1st deadline to meet certain requirements in order to keep working on the former SR site. Among those requirements was the company proving it had $200 million immediately available for the project. The agency also gave the company deadlines, including completing construction of the pellet plant and shipping at least 3 million tons of pellets by the end of 2020. According to the DNR, none of those requirements were met. Masabi has 20 days to prove otherwise or the lease will officially end. Officials with the company said the pandemic delayed the remainder of the $200 million payment and they expect it to be paid in full in the coming weeks. This isn't the first time the company has missed deadlines. That's why some Iron Range lawmakers are celebrating today's decision. State Representative Julie Sandstead said it's a new day for the region and she hopes to see Cleveland Cliffs take over. Cleveland Cliffs is a company that has demonstrated their ability time and time again um, in the past three years. They've made investments of over $173 million. And what Lorenzo Gonzalez says he's going to do. Representative Dave Lizagard also weighed in, saying he too wants to see the project move forward with a viable and credible partner. He says the region has lost time and economic opportunity waiting on Masabi Metallics. Cleveland Cliffs is also reacting to the news tonight. The company owns land and has mineral rights near Masabi Metallic's project. In a statement to CBS3 Tonight, Cliffs president and CEO Lorenzo Gonzalez said Cliffs applauds the DNR's decision today, adding, as soon as the leases are legally terminated, Cliffs is ready to step in and develop the Nashwalk project.